For a long time, I thought sustainability is about energy use. And not until I built my own house did I realize that sustainability includes food and where the food comes from. There has been a trend in our food system of creating more and more distance between the farmer and the consumer. So whether that be in food miles or actually as a relationship and an understanding of what's happening on the farm and what's happening on the plate, there's a disconnect there. There's an urgency in industrial agriculture to shift out of this model that we've created that is very extractive, both of the people that it employs and the resources that it's using. We said, okay, let's try something new. Let's look at greenhouses. That's a way to grow food all year long, locally, with an amazing quality. Clients come to Ceres because we are offering the most sustainable growing solution that is available. And we have been able to prove and are continuing to prove that we can grow plants with really minimal inputs and get more yield out of a space than most people can in other structures. So Ottawa is an extremely difficult climate to grow in. We are basically in a winter mode for almost nine months of the year. So that environment that we create, the series greenhouse creates, allows us to take as much free stuff from another nature as we can. It's really important for Colorado to harness the sunshine that it gets, so we're able to do that during the winter time as well using the passive solar greenhouse design by Ceres. And this allows us to really control a lot of aspects in our production. As you can see right now, we're growing flowers and herbs, and we're in the middle of January. Being that schools traditionally are sourcing food pulled in in bulk quantities from miles and miles away from where the students are actually consuming the food. And here at Ceres, we care and understand that students who come to school and have healthy, nutritious lunches available to them not only do better in the classroom, but also bring what they've learned and what they're eating at home to their friends and families where they can make better decisions how they're sourcing their food as well. Fresh food grown nearby tastes better. And with that, it's also likely more full of vital nutrients. Goal would be that the food is where the consumers are. Um, and I think if you connect the consumers to the producer, because they're in the same neighborhood, they're neighbors. It's community, you're starting to create community. You know what they say, good food makes good people. Our main driver is not actually the greenhouse that we build and the facility that helps grow the food. It is actually the food that is grown and the community that is created with that food. This is what drives everything that we do.